excuse me. Hello, welcome to uh, Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. It's episode 131, and we're starting our countdown to Halloween um, with the first of four Halloween specials. So we're starting you off gently. I don't think they've got any super scary games tonight. In fact, it's very possible we've played all the super scary games in the past couple of years. Um, so... We're going to be playing horror-adjacent horror games uh, these next four episodes, I believe. Um, so, there you go. Um, we'll hopefully we'll be having a, a horror teacher for each, um, each episode. And um, an, an eclectic selection. Now, as it currently stands... We currently have six games per um, per episode for the next four weeks. Um, that doesn't give us a lot of leeway if we've got any that don't work or that are rubbish. So we'll be um, we'll be adding to the list. I've got four shows planned out, but. Um, We'll probably add and change them. Um, however, shall we crack on with it? Let's move across to the game screen. Okay, we're going to start with Death Trap. Uh, this is, as you can see, this is an Atari 2600 uh, VCS game from 1983. And um, I've got... No idea what sort of game it is, but it had death in the title, so you know it's got to be good. Um, also, don't know if the music's going to work, but um, let's play it and find out. So, I haven't changed, I haven't done any settings on the controller or anything like that. So, let's just see what happens. Let's see if it's just going to work. Oh, well, that did something, didn't it? Okay. I thought it was a bit optimistic, really. Uh, edit game controls. Let's have a look. See, why does it say keyboard? Why? Why does it say keyboard? It should know by now. Ah. Uh, okay. No? Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. I don't think it'll make any difference at all. So, but let's, let's restart it. Okay, so it's been restarted with the correct controller now. So... Okay, so... Oh! Right, I'm not sure... What I'm supposed to be shooting at, to be honest. Am I supposed to be shooting the white line that goes across? No, that didn't work. Oh, that's weird. You can't see anything. Okay. Let's try that again, shall we? It's not showing it. It's not showing it. Oh, now it's showing it. I tell you, I've got... Oh, what? What? 
What goes on with computers? Why? Why did it change? <sighs> right. Let's try again. Can't run into those coloured bars. Wow, you only get one life. Oh, oh, oh! What do they do? What did what what? So. So every time I hit the guns, I, I get a... Oh. Tell you, these are the games where you wish you had... Um, <coughs> excuse me, where you wish you had... A joystick that just went left and right. Thanks. Don't know what the different symbols are. Oh, it's difficult. It's difficult. And you only get one life. We've only got one, um... We've only got one life, and we should keep trying. And um, we've only got six games to play tonight, so... I think I get the gist, but... happens when I get a bar, a, like a, I'm not going to find out because I'm going to die horribly, but what happens when we get all the way through? Oh. It's weird. I don't know what you're actually seeing at your end because what I'm looking at isn't flashing in the same way. Uh, we got a reasonable score then. So. Let's try that one. What does the square give us? Any di any difference? Yeah, you see those, the, the horizontal lines. Well. I'm not seeing them flashing in the same way you are. Smaller gaps are appearing though. Is this more difficult? Oh, there's less white cloudy bullety things. It's 
weird. I'm not sure what what's going on. Sometimes it goes through, and other times it doesn't. Is it the... Uh, I don't know. Is it the white gaps that are... Oh, I've ran into the bloody, bloody bugger. See, that looked like I had lots of ships left. But then we start at the start again. Um, okay, well. Have we completed our time with a uh, death trap? Um, I don't know. Only got six games. It's going to be very short if we uh, leave them after seven minutes. Let's do one more. Let's do the dot. See if we can spot anything different now that we've... Uh... Yes, it's a lot more difficult. Okay, let's move on, let's move on. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to, uh, we're going to play a game that we have played before and I'm going to resume it and we're going to carry on from where we left it, as you can no doubt hear. So this, um, let's get your screen. This is uh, Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas, colon, The Pumpkin King. And we, we, con we, we worked some way through it. And I feel that like every Halloween and, uh, and every Christmas needs a little dose of Jack Skellington. So um, we're going to do that now on the Game Boy Advanced. You might have thought that I said advanced then, but I didn't. I said advanced. Mm hmm. Yep, yeah, around it. Uh, okay. Yep, I thought it did that, so let's just move it up and left. How's that? That's better. Okay. Now I have to remember how all the controls. Updated you on the story, but do you know what? I can't remember what it was. I guess we're having save Christmas or save Halloween or something. Do it, come on, move, 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 move. Oh, I see. 
Yes, yes, we know. No, he's skipping through the chatting. Played like this, shouldn't it? Let's uh Ooh. Oh. Guess you have to get to the middle to um kick off the spiders. Get that one. Oh, what's happening? That looks like a victory dance, doesn't it? Oh, nutty cluff clusters in the house. Ready for nightmare before Christmas. House, we can go past Jack's house. Oh, but everything else locked till we're going to Jack's house. Mm. 
Oh. Yeah, that was the shit start on it. At least we um, don't have to do the spiders again. Question mark? Yes, we do. Cock. Oh. I think with save points and shit like that, that um, we won't have to do this again. Skip this either. Is there a, there's not a save or anything, is there? Oh, however. Just do a quick save. And we'd have to do all that again. Jump from that. Oh, rack off your dag. <sighs> they just hate it and that happens. Why 
did you not, not go grab onto it? Now, I wonder if because we've spoken to the mayor, whether that's where we start from. Shall we find out? Sod that. Let's, um, let's do that. God, he doesn't have a lot of um doesn't have a lot of juice, does he? Just a little smack in the face and he's done. Um okay. I think that's it. For um for Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas, The Pumpkin King. That's it. For this week and it's possible we might have a running theme where Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas appears again in October at some point question mark we'll see we'll see but for now let's move on to um, to moderators choice Moderator's choice, yes. Um, so while we were compiling games that we've never played before that we might want to play, I did foolishly give Nutty Cluster some input. I asked for her input, sorry. And um, she picked a couple of games, and we're going to play them both this evening. Um, but make no mistake, they are... Moderator's choice. So um, let us uh, have a look at uh, the first of our games. And we're playing them in a different order because we're already looking at Game Boy Advance. But really, we've got a Game Boy and a Game Boy Advance. I don't know what to say. But here is Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Yes, I know, I know, but we're going to play them anyway. Um, so, this is Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Potion Commotion. Oh, there she is, Clarissa. Potion Commotion. 
actually, actually, in a prime, Nutty Cluster used to look like that. She did. Oh, have I made it quiet? I wonder if there's any noise. There is, there is some noise. Are you all following along at home? Oh, we must find four ingredients. Do you know, I thought Potion Commotion might be a puzzle game. So, there are some puzzle aspects. where the cat face has gone. Must be in this cup top corner then. Where did I only score five? Oh I see, it didn't mean to just jump over it then. Thank you. 
Okay, he said press up. Mm, oh, did it mean this? Guess so. cat this time go back in this? I have a horrible feeling we don't. But, oh, don't know. There's nowhere to go, is there? I don't think. I'm sorry for retracing my steps, everybody. But there's no way out of here. So, let's run it. Where do we want now? Is that something I need to? St yes, I need to stop that. It's quite enough of that. Simon. Yes, Naughty Cluster, it's Sabrina. We've already told everybody that it's a uh, moderator's choice. Oh, that's an annoying control. Can't remember now, were we going up or down? We're going down, I think, weren't we? So, have we completed everything in this room? Do we go back out? Okay, well, I don't know how we completed it, but we completed that. So 
we don't have to magic all the things that move. We can just... Um... Oh, I'm being pushed along. Jumped over there. Stupid. Right, I can't seem to. Right. Oh, now it's going to get me from the other side. I can't seem to cast my spells for some reason. Oh no! We're doing this again, are we? I'm gonna say, if I don't get some soon, I'm gonna forget where everything is. the other pizza, aren't we? Oh, piss off. Where did I see the pizza? Quite sure what the difference of um, why the taskmaster or whatever his name is has got so many points. That's the problem with being so near the um Did it did you? Let's get a bit of distance. Why did I not get to here sooner? So... I need to get the spell then, I guess. Um, how do I get out of this area? So we've got some up there. Oh, I, oh, I see what you're saying, right. So how do I, how do I do that? No, select. Uh, 
Okay, nope, not that one. Oh, what about that one? Get in there. Oh, try again. Oh, tell you what. Let's pick them up so we can do uh, another magic trick later. So what have we just picked up there? A wig. Woo, and also who? Well, do you know what? I think we should probably leave Sabrina where she is because we've played her the most tonight. So, um... And, and, and what I didn't tell you is we have uh, a second uh, Sabrina game that Naughty Cluster picked. She did. Um, now, let's have a, just a quick look and see if that's ready. Yes, it is. So it's it's a Game Boy game. Uh, so we're going to put it in the proper screen. Oh, who would have thought I would be playing Sabrina the Teenage Witch games at Halloween? So this is Sabrina the Animated Series. And it's called Spooked. And back in the old days, that just made me think of uh, a comedian we used to have on the telly back in the old days who wore a white suit with black arrows on it. And he used to say Spooked. Um, I can't remember his name offhand. But anyway, here we go. A bit more Sabrina. Game Boy Colour. Imagine it's not called Sabrina the Teenage Witch because she looks about five. Let's turn it down. Oh, and jump. What, what you'd expect from a good old platform game. So. Let's assume we have to collect these. Oh. Toss off. Here we go. Right. I like to believe you have to touch them like that. No. Oh, no. So you can't kill the bad guys, is that right? What? No. No killy killy. Is he a good guy? Bad guy. Bad guy! Any of the guys, bad guys. That's what I'm learning. Oh no. Why can't I get on there then? Oh, now! Why did he die? I think we have to be down here, don't we? 
So, can I... Oh, I can jump on them like Mario. Like, like that. Oh, no, oh, like that. Okay, can't do anything with them now. Oh, the diamond day. Now, I felt I jumped on his head then. So, diamonds that are important, aren't they? They're the ones, that's what we need to get. Now, there was one up here, wasn't there, I think? Didn't think he could get me up there. Stinking pig dog. nice if just once I could jump off the edge of a thing and actually hit the right instead of doing that. Thing is I don't have a lot of life left now do I? So if I get hit again Good music. Is it? See why it's out there? It's almost like it wants you to jump on it. get to be how do I open that oh it's another one come on then cat face come on how do you operate Salem would you just press select? You do. Okay, okay. Well, 
Salem can't seem to kill things. Let's see if Sabrina can do any better. Maybe she doesn't need to. Oh, thing is, do I need to... Ah, I do need to make Salem do it as well. there, don't we? Is that the way we're going? Uh -huh. Yeah, well, okay. Exit. Oh, where's the exit? Did we come in this way? Oh, I don't know. What's this direction, just in case? I do think it's this way. started have we yeah we've come back is there a map or something stupid that I should have seen can I get on there can I can I oh I'm gonna have to go all the way back fuck So it has to be this way. What am I missing? There is no way out that way. Okay. Die, it. We need to get across there, don't we? How do we do that? She's got a worse jump than Salem has. Uh, Not do anything. So is there some Salem skill that No, she can't jump on top of him. I mean, they've both got to be able to get 
across there because that's they have to go with each other we don't go under do we no we don't I mean you can't pick these up can you oh no was I doing that before I was sure I was firing things. Um, I don't know. I don't know. We're a bit stuck. Um. So I'm going to say that um, Sabrina has come to the end of her time in Retro Lounge um, until we've run out of uh, other games that we have to play and um, I'm sure she'll be dragged back in kicking and screaming uh, okay right well at the moment we have two more two more games left um one on the Game Gear, and one on a console we've never played before. So, uh, let's go to the Game Gear first. And, um, oh, do you know what? We're going to play it on the game... We're going to play it on this screen. On the Game Boy screen, because it's square. It's a square, so uh, we shall play it on the square screen. In fact, I'm not actually sure what the um, screen ratio is of the uh, the next console, to be honest. But we will find out together. Okay, this is devilish. Like I say, it's on the Game Gear. Let's turn it up a little bit until we want to turn it back down again. Ooh, it's a bit devilish. Let's play a normal game. Should we play easy? Yeah, well, of course we're going to play easy. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, I hate breakout with these pads. Oh, there's a devil. Balls. Oh! That was... And that was uneasy as well. Okay, let's try again. At least now we know what we're up against. We're up against me being shit. No! Referee.
like a hyper version of Breakout. Yeah. Oh! See, it's when they're separating out, it's, it's like, confuses me. Confuses my poor brain. Okay. Again. Oh! See, why did it shoot up like that? That was the worst one yet. Oh, it's all about it. It's resetting the game. Through the gap, that's it. Oof. What 
Huh. Well, yay, we get to see a different um, thingy. Shit, I was looking at whether the bloody audio was working. Well, now what? Make me start right back at the start in it. Hey, we've got fifth best player. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I apologize, game. I'm trying. Oh! We nearly saw the big bad getting got. I wonder where it's going to start me at. Oh.
No, come back this way. Hey, we didn't spend as long with that, did we? Means we've got more lives to get this bugger. Oh, it's got to take. We just wasted all our lives. Oh, and again. that Jimmy well if nothing else we've seen a devilish devil get his devilish dues dues I didn't see any way out of that but on the upside it should start as a no referee um, that was devilish on the game gear and now what we're going to do is we're going to holy moly that's large said the vicar um, we might have a problem here Um, <laughs> right, I've just opened this game and it's come out sideways. So, I don't think it's... I don't... I can't turn it... I don't think I can turn it. Eventually. Perhaps with a different emulator it might... Um, so we were going to play something on the Wonder Swan. But this is the first time I've opened a Wonder Swan game. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, well, we said we were going to exp. Oh no, it's open full screen. That's not what we want. So, we've got a, a different emulator that we could use. However, uh, it's currently set to open full screen. Which is um, bad. There we go. So, um, if I, uh, we should really say we used to use it every now and again. Um, but if I search. Uh, For a game okay oh okay so I'm just gonna see what it does when it opens and then if not yeah that's opened it the wrong way as well um the other thing is it's all in Japanese so we want to be playing any wonder swan this uh this halloween season uh which is a shame it's always nice to look at different things uh, and see different stuff so what we're gonna do is we're gonna steal um oh it means we're gonna have to find lots of other games uh okay okay well that's a that's a trauma for another day so then let's um, have a look at the rest of the games that we have. For that, I'm just deleting all the wonder. The, we had three wonder wonder swan games, but if they're gonna hope open horizontally, actually, do you know what? With that said, we're gonna go back to the screen. Let's pop this on.
Ooh. And we're going to say goodbye. Yes, yes we are. A um, little bit shorter than normal. But um, I'll make sure we move some of these games around. And do you know what? I might even start them to see if they work. I know, right? I know. But that's the end of our first Halloween special for this year. Um, you can email us if you like, uh, if you've got a specific horror game. I do have a list of the ones we've already played, but we'll certainly have a look and try and accommodate. Um, in fact, you know, if we get enough requests, we could make the, the Halloween episode, the one nearest Halloween, a request episode. I know, I know, nobody will write in. But, but it's an interesting thought, isn't it? Um, so, yes, Retro at Snug Radio. The website is snugradio.co.uk. Uh, visit us there for all the things snuggly. Um, we are, if well, if you're watching this live on a Monday night at, from 7 o'clock, well, you know we're on Twitch at Snug Radio. But if you're watching it on YouTube, well, number one, you know that we're on YouTube as Snug Radio. But uh, did you know you could come and watch it live on a Monday and request games and all that sort of stuff? Just head on over to Twitch. Find us there. Um, but other than YouTube and Twitch, we're also on Facebook, Twitter, TikTok as Snug Radio. Um, if you like library music, we do uh, we do Elevenses on Twitch from 11 o'clock where we play... Uh, library, easy listening, instrumental, all that sort of stuff. Um, sometimes it gets muted in the recordings because of copyright issues. So if you want to catch it all and catch it live, that's the way of not getting any annoying muted stuff. Um, so there are all the things that you can uh, you can find the snug. Oh, and the Discord. You can come to the Discord and join us there. Uh, there'll be a link link for you somewhere um so if you really want to help then uh nutty cluster and myself have design shops nutty cluster's design shop is called ink inspiration where you can find all the best taskmaster quote merch that your heart desires yes the new series of taskmaster has started i'm certain within the next couple of weeks there'll be new merch with new quotes um, going into that shop so that's ink inspiration just um, scan the code and help nutty cluster earn a living that's cool and it helps the show as well because you know when she's happy she picks better games and that sort of thing um, but helping the show more directly would be going to my uh, shop at Redbubble called the glorious idiot uh, full of designs. Um, recently had a run of cats drinking coffee, different styles of cats. Um, there's a pretty cool Pink Panther esque type cat drinking a coffee. That's that's kind of cool. That would look good on a mug. Um, so, yes, spend all your hard earned cash there. Hey, look, we've got some Halloween merch and possibly Christmas merch. You know, Christmas is just around the corner after Halloween. So, you know. What better place to find something for the geek in your life than uh, Ink Inspiration or The Glorious Idiot? So, and, and that's, my friends, is it. Um, we will be back at the same time, same place next week with more Halloween goodies. I say Halloween. I, I should do it like this, shouldn't I? Halloween goodies. Um, but until then, I think, um, that's it. So, I've been Muff. This has been Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Till next time, play something spooky. Bye.